and for the little fat guy in the one cubicle office speaking on watches, speaking on Rick Ross and his automir. It's unbelievable, isn't it, fat guy, little piglet? Oh, those emeralds are so rare. So, would be so hard for a black man to obtain such a rare time piece of the a simple feat for a boss. And I stay out of grown folks' business, little piglet. Get out of that one cubicle office and go and see the world. You on Rose Dick. And that was a simple feat. Ain't no money. Huh? Hold on, Come on, piglet. Piglet. Hey, little piglet. Hee-haw. Come on, piglet. A mother in a cubicle could say, hey, Rick, the Phantom's not real. Rick, that was stolen. Shut the fuck up, piglet. Hee-haw. Oh, no, 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 we not finished. No, no, no. No. The STO, it's not the red f***ing Aventador. That's not, you see the wing? No, it's not red and little piglet, he honk. <laughs> no, I'm just playing, y'all. Leave piglet alone. <laughs> Ross, bro, I just made a video about your insane green AP. Unfortunately, it's fake. Why are you flaunting fake watches? There's only one of these watches in the world in 41 mil. And there's another one in 37. There's more coming in the future, but because of the complexity and the difficulty to find these stones, there's currently only one in the world. Can you explain me this, Rick Ross? Why is there a photo here with my name and Nico Leonard and the photo of that exact watch? That's the real deal. And you have a fake. The real owner sent me this photo and you have a fake watch. No cap. Media Productions.